all in a day's bolting. My stick clip broke. Forgot my drill. Got a thunderstorm on the way out. G'day, I'm out here at Elphinstone, my favorite cliff in the whole wide world. And I'm out here bolting a new route that I've already bolted. And actually I'm out here to fix a mistake I made. I'll tell you about it. All right, yeah, so I'm here underneath Wombat Roof. Uh, my latest and greatest awesome project out at Elphinstone. It's potentially gonna be somewhere in about the 36 range. I've spent a few days climbing on it now and worked out that I've made a few mistakes while bolting. Namely, there's a bolt missing right up the very top and it's kind of the only clipping position and there's nothing to clip other than a temporary screw that I've left in there for now. So my mission today is to get up there to the very top and I'm gonna put in a new bolt. It's a bit of a frustrating one really because the time to result ratio is disproportionately whacked in this. It's gonna take me the best part of five hours to get up there and put in one bolt. So let's just briefly go through the gear that I've got with me for today. Harness, black diamond big gun, two loops, really good for bolting. Uh, I've got my rope, pongu stick clip, earmuffs, water, impact driver, slings and bits, more of them to come, snacks, glue gun, snazzy glasses, chalk bag and more bits, bolting bag, hammer, glue, nozzles, my bolt, brought two bolts just in case I drop one, hole cleaning brush, drill, and a stack more other bits and bobs. Let's clip in and we'll shoot up. Um, in true bolting fashion, everything that can go wrong will go wrong. Sometimes it's forgetting a bit of gear, sometimes it's dropping a bit of gear. Today, my stick clip has broken, which is really frustrating. I really like this Pongu stick clip, but yeah, this bottom bit has broken and I would say that it is the one downside to the Pongoose is that their telescopic extension uh, has a bit to be desired for, but I really like the head and so I'll just persist with it. And away we go. Pretty much right on the tip, uh, somewhere out there, is where we want to put the bolt in. So I'm going to race up there ASAP as thunder coming in. Out there I can kind of see the clouds rolling through. Yeah, I'd like to not get caught in that and get up before it goes too hectic. So we'll keep on chugging up, nearly there. Brad. How's this for a position? Um, so this, this is the bolt, this one here. Um, it's kind of a good hold around the corner here. Okay, little edge here. You get a bit of a like clampy thing and clip. And I've just been clipping this concrete screw, um, as you can see. Uh, so I want to put in a proper bolt somewhere here. Go. Need a battery. Let's try that again. Excellent. To put in one bolt, you pretty much bring the same amount of gear plus a little bit more steel 
when you go to put in the entire route. It's a lot of time, a lot of effort. Hopefully it's worth it though. Look at that, ready to go in a few hours. You know, I was saying that sometimes you forget stuff, stuff breaks, blah, 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 yeah. Um, my rattle gun to take out this concrete screw is on the ground a long way below us. And I don't have enough time to go down and get back up, so. Hi, yeah, future Tom here, interrupting present day Tom. Here's your drill, mate. Would have been good to have that up there like 30 minutes ago, wouldn't it? Doofus. You get that on the big jobs. Show you some of these holds up on the top here. Now that we've got our bolt in. Come through down below there. There's our roof. Come through up here. This is the second roof. Come out. Clip this new bolt. And then you've got this little thing here and then you pop across to this little thing look at that not very good and then over to this and you end up with a foot and a hand on there spin over to these and then you head up to where that white rope is anchored few raindrops coming in now, I'm going to try and get out before the rain kicks in. I'm not going to make it out. Emergency raincoat. Deploy. But I reckon if you hit the like button, the rain will hold off for a couple of minutes for me, so... Do us a favour, I don't want to get wet. Hit the like button, thanks. We didn't make it! Thunder and lightning! All I needed was a like! Just give me a like! and the sun will come out, please. Thanks for watching.